Hi guys, it's me again. Um, it is January 6th. It is 8.15 in the morning and we're going to be walking again. Um, I'm doing the um, walking 20 minutes every other day and then um, on the days I do weight training I only do 15 minutes because I do about 15-20 minutes of weight training too. Um, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday is when I do the weight training, and then Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday is when I do the 20 minute walking. Um, I haven't completely decided if I'm going to do Saturdays or not. It may just be Tuesdays and Thursdays that I do the 20 minute walk, but um, we'll see. I am, I have a note 4, if you see this on me. That's because um, it records my, how many steps I take. It's a pedometer, I think that's what they call it. Um, also, I wanted to let you guys know that those of you that are friends with me on um, my fitness pal, I did change my menu yesterday. It was out of my control <laughs> because of the fact that um, my oven had gone out. I live in an apartment. And my he my oven had bef right after Christmas, New Year time, um, my oven decided to um, buzz and then shoot fire at me from under the door, and melted the heating coil inside, and so um, they had to replace my oven uh, or replace the whole stove. And so they decided to come at lunchtime, and they stayed until 4.30 in the afternoon, so which meant I skipped lunch yesterday um, because I couldn't leave with workmen here. So um, they also gave me a new fridge, which I was happy about because the appliances in this apartment are from like the 70s and 80s is what they were, and they were so old. And I would, the company that owned this place beforehand... Um, in my old fridge, the plastic on the very bottom shelf had cracked in half, and their idea of fixing it was putting duct tape. Yeah, instead of replacing, they put duct tape, um, because they couldn't find any more shelves for that unit, um, because it was so old. Um, so, this one, and the new company, they replace the stove and the fridge. So, I was very happy <laughs> to have that happen. Um, but, that meant my menu changed yesterday. Um, let's go ahead and get started. What we're doing, for those of you that are starting out with me, um, I'm doing a two point, I'm on a NordaTrack treadmill. I'm doing um, 2.5 miles per hour at a 4% incline um, for today is for 20 minutes and then um, tomorrow, sorry I have this one moment, I had a cord because I was going to record with my tablet but it's dead so it won't let me so I took that out, um, I took the cable out that I was um, plugging mine into and now I'm using my daughter's. Um, but anyway, um, what I was saying, I'm on a NordaTrack treadmill. I am at 4% inclined at 2.5 miles per hour. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Let me get the incline and then I'll tell you when to start as soon as we get there. Let me hook this little neat thing. This is, if you fall off, it pulls this, um, it's a little piece that's connected to the, by a magnet to the NordTrack, and if that automatically stops if you fall. So it'll automatically stop the treadmill, which is a good thing. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, let me go ahead at three two, one, start. Oh, 
Okay. Now, as I was saying before, um, my menu yesterday changed. Um, I did go over. I'll explain that to you, too. I was supposed to be at um, between 1,000 and 1,200, and I went to 1,216 calories. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys um, with everything so that even when I mess up, you're going to know about it. Um, what I did yesterday is for breakfast, I had my omelet and I had my coffee. And then um, I had, for snack, I had went ahead and I had my Greek yogurt. And for lunch, then I wasn't able to eat any lunch. I did have a banana, um, but I couldn't cook anything because they were in my kitchen. And then for afternoon snack, I had another yogurt. And then after that, for dinner, I had what I said I was going to have. The, um, I had six ounces of a hamburger steak, and I had about half a cup of potatoes, about half a cup of frozen green beans cooked, and um, I had um, about a quarter of a cup of gravy on it. And then for my evening snack, that's where I messed up. I was hungry, so I um, made me, I had had a banana, and then um, about an hour or so later I was hungry again. So I went ahead and um, changed to, uh, I went ahead and made me some cream of wheat and two pieces of toast. This is the second time I've done cream of wheat. I figured out I can't have cream of wheat. I guess the toast and the cream of wheat, um, those of you that don't know me, I dump if I get too many carbs. And I guess toast and cream of wheat is way too many carbs for me. So I dumped last night. So I will not be having cream of wheat again. Um, I also have started putting my daughter on the treadmill because she needs to exercise. She doesn't, it's not the losing weight, she just needs to get some exercise because she likes to sit in her room, she's 13, and play on her tablet and watch her TV and she gets no exercise. So I said, Fine, for 30 minutes a day, babe, you are going to get on your, um, on the treadmill and walk. And I put her at a zero incline at two miles per hour because she has short little legs. Um, those of you that don't know her, she, we adopted her from Guatemala. She's Mayan Indian and she's just tiny, very tiny. <laughs> So she looks like she's like 9, 10 years old, but she's not. She's 13. Anyway, I'm already running out of breath. We're at 4 minutes. Well, I did a little video of her on the treadmill last night and <laughs> she was like, Mom, don't video my butt. And I'm like, honey, I'm not. I'm videotaping your legs for Nanny. Because <laughs> my mom was afraid that it was too fast for her. So I videotaped it and texted it to her so she can see that I'm not killing my daughter. <laughs> but right now it's just too cold outside to go walking. I don't want her getting sick. So that's why we're doing the treadmill. We're at five, 
2.8 seconds, 5 minutes and 10 seconds. I don't know if I'll make it to 20 minutes. Realize that I've only been, I just started this back up, the exercising, so I'm out of shape. I'm going to go today and go get me, I get these, the Propel um, drink, the powder, little packets, I can get them at H-E-B. And I get those because there's no calories in them. I found out the generic ones have five calories with each, with each packet. And I don't want any calories. Sorry, I had to pause it for a second. It was just, I couldn't breathe. I had em I have emphysema. I used to be on oxygen. If you see my beginning videos, you see the oxygen on me. But since I lost the weight, I don't have to be on oxygen anymore. I used to be in a wheelchair and I'm not in that anymore. But I still run out of breath. So far, I've walked 980 steps. <laughs> See how many steps it takes for 15 minutes. I just slowed this treadmill down to 2 miles per hour because the 2.5 was just too much. But, and I couldn't catch my breath. Which you kind of need to breathe when you're exercising. I know you guys mean can do it faster than me, but I can't. As I go along, I'll be able to do it faster, but right now I can't. But I am exercising, so that's all that counts. Is that I'm actually moving. We're almost at nine minutes because I did pause it. That's why I'm at nine minutes. just so I could catch my breath. But we may just be going to 15 minutes today. 20 minutes is just a little out of my reach for right now. minutes. 
bumped it back up to the 2.5. The incline it's harder than just 2.5 at a flat. So I'm walking up a constant small hill. Eleven minutes. Those of you that I'm friends with on YouTube and Facebook and everything, my challenge to you is to start videotaping your exercise. Put it onto YouTube so we all can exercise together. and a half minutes. distance I've walked 0.5 miles about half a mile minutes. My heart rate is 150. more seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, that was 15 minutes, guys. Let me take my pulse. See what my pulse rate is at.
Okay. Take this off of here because okay. it says 102. So it's come down a little bit since I've been playing around. But anyway, okay. Well, I will let you guys go. Thank you for exercising with me. And I hope to see you tomorrow. I will talk to you later. Bye.